guys, it's me, Tina Marie, with True Meaning of Radiance. Yes, I got on a Christmas shirt. Yes, I do, because I'm in my PJs. I'm just chilling today. I'm actually having a relax and reset day. So I'm resetting myself, and yeah, I'm just enjoying my own company, okay? So today's video, well, this evening's video, when you're seeing it, is a review on the Light Up Wallflower from Bath and Body Works. This is the crystal ball. This one is absolutely beautiful. Yes, I paid an upcharge and got one on Macari. Now I have a second one as well. And the second one, actually, I'm giving to my mom because she really does like these. So um, I'm going to be giving my extra one to my mom. And I want to try it out, let you guys know is it good? Is it not? So I'm going to put a side by side or something like that. That way you guys can see it. It does go for $18.50. The price alone is not that bad. You would think it would be in the 20 something dollar range, just like that um, glow up ghost that they have. And the crazy thing is people saying that that ghost is getting extremely hot and they had to even un unplug it because it was getting too hot. So if you have one of them fluorescent light up ghosts, let me know. Are you experiencing that? Let me know in the comments below. And I also want to share with you guys how to get free wallflower plugs. Now these plugs, these plugs can always be taken back to the store. I don't know if you don't know that hack, but now you know the hack, okay? You can always take them back to the store. Now the thing is you have to get one that's equal to the value of the one that you paid or a lesser value. So I can't go in there with the basic one and get one of these. That's $18.50. No, you have to do the same for the same or, you know, you can take one of these back and get a $7 one day. Fine with that. But you want to stay within the same. So if you're one of those people that once the holiday is over, you're like, okay, I'm done with this one. I want to take it back. You can take it back and exchange it. I'm a collector. So I don't do this with them. But if you have the regular basic ones, every about two to three months, they go where you can't really smell them like you used to. And when they get to that point and you start to notice at the top that it has discoloration and stuff like that, take them things back. Put them in a little Bath and Body Works bag, take them back to the store and they'll exchange them out for you, no hassle. If you wanna make sure you can call the store first, but a part of their guarantee on them is they have a lifetime warranty. So you always can take them back. When they start where you can't really smell it, take it back, exchange it for a new one. Um, the only ones I don't take back, like the ones that don't mean a lot to me, I don't mind taking them back, but stuff like this, oh no, it's gonna stay with me. And the thing is, I'm not gonna use this for three months. I'm not even gonna use this for three months, like maybe a month, month and a half max is what I'm going to use with this one. So that's a little trick, a little hack if you didn't know. These um, plugins have a lifetime warranty lifetime okay so if it stops working for any reason or it stops smelling anything take it back take it back exchange it get a new one okay if you're a seasonal person the season's over you're going to go and get one that's for spring take it back as long as it has the same price value you'll go ahead and um, get the new one and you don't need your receipt or anything like that so that's a good program bath and body works has if you guys didn't know now we're gonna go ahead and get into my favorite wallflowers. These are my top ones that offer maximum scent. You can leave your top ones in the comments below. But Harvest Pomegranate to me is one of the new bees that joined this year for fall and it is out of this world. The candle is amazing. Also, the plug-in is amazing. That pomegranate comes through like nobody's business. This is definitely one I would purchase over and over again. The next one is Brilliant Citrus. It's an odor eliminating one. Love this in the kitchen because in the kitchen you get all them different smells, especially if you're cooking and you should be cooking. Everybody can't afford to eat out every day now, so you should be cooking, okay? So getting that odor eliminating is the best one because it will help with those smells especially I love bacon. I like making bacon in the air fryer, but I do not like the smell of bacon. I hate the way it lingers like, ugh. So having the odor eliminator is good. Another one shouldn't be a surprise, pumpkin pecan waffles. That thing is super strong, like super de duper strong. Like you can get choked out from a pumpkin pecan waffle. I swear you can. I swear you can. Um, but it does give that smell and it packs that punch you are looking for when it comes towards a wallflower refill. So it's definitely at the top of my list and I love the smell of it anyway. Now, Pink Fairy Gumdrop. I'm telling you, I put this in Justin's room and within five to six minutes, the whole room smells like Pink Fairy Gumdrop. 
when this one comes back this winter, I am going ham. And I don't want to hear nothing, y'all. I don't want to hear nothing from nobody. I am going ham. I'm going to have at least 20 of these. Minimum. This one right here is good, good. And Pink Fairy Gumdrop, even if you have to go on Macari to get it, y'all need it. I'm telling you, get her. Another good one, Watermelon Lemonade. I know we forget about Watermelon Lemonade, but Watermelon Lemonade is super strong. Like, I just put one and plugged it up by um, my doorway. And I was like, what is that smell? And it's like, hit me in the face. It's Watermelon Lemonade. So, to me, Watermelon Lemonade, it does give off that scent. So, it's a really good one to have in your refill arsenal so watermelon lemonade you have made the list but watermelon lemonade sometimes that scent gets overwhelming another one is eucalyptus and mint and i also want to say anything eucalyptus like the stress relief one bomb those are great for in the bathroom they eliminate odor and they smell super strong super strong so i recommend the eucalyptus mint and the stress relief version as well the eucalyptus and spearmint those ones are really good what is your favorite like eucalyptus or minty type scent that bath and body works offers like that you would want to put in the top ones definitely fill us in let us know below and of course mahogany teakwood high intensity Woo, that man's sexy that man is sexy i love mahogany teakwood high intensity it's everything i love having it in the garage my garage be smelling so sexy and manly and i love it in the bathroom as well well you need this boo you need this all right mahogany teakwood high intensity is definitely a must for any refill collection finish my review on the crystal ball so the crystal ball thing is not too flimsy um but it's not heavy like i thought it would be a little bit more heavy than it was but it is what it is. It gives off a nice pop of color. It's not going to be like, oh my goodness, like the, the the ones that have the projector on them and all that. No, nah, it don't do all that. It just give a little bit of light, just a little bit, so you can look a little cute. So it's, it's nice. I'm not going to say it's bad. There's nothing bad about it. It did exactly what I wanted it to do, and the price was right. I mean, $18.95 is not a bad price. I'll say that again for this um, refill plug-in. So this is definitely one that I would repurchase. Um, especially with a 20% off coupon <laughs> y'all know me about coupon life so definitely if you see it in your area grab it I know it's sold out online it went quick quick um but check it out well, that's it guys that's my review on this little pretty thing right here what is your thoughts on the new crystal ball that they have for Halloween definitely let me know in the comments below remember rate comment subscribe i love you guys let me finish my chill mode for the day and i'll see you guys later bye guys